of the program. Uh, he just recently moved to Poland. He's been doing the open mics on a regular basis and once again also getting better and better. He's a very funny man. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for Daniel. Woo! Thanks, Derek. Hi, I'm Daniel. Hi, Daniel. Hi. Good students. <laughs> All right, so, um, so the other day a lady asked, came up to me and she asked me where I'm from. And uh, I, don't, I don't speak Polish yet, so I was wondering, I was like, wondering like, what is she, what is she asking me? And uh, like, what is it, like, where are you from in Polish? Uh, I don't think you're right, I think it's Korea, Japan. <laughs> <laughs> But like I got that, and I was like, okay, okay, uh, no, I was like, oh, America, and she's like, oh, America, cool, California, New York, and I was like, Texas, yeah, <laughs> and then her response to that was like, oh, Texas, uh, cowboy, pew pew, <laughs> and I was like feeling good, and I was like, I, right, you know. A little out of date. Uh, yeah, school shooting. Pew pew. <laughs> <laughs> Thing is, uh, yeah, I'm from Texas, but I, uh, I, like, I was only born there. My family's actually from Vietnam. And woo, hello, Vietnamese people. Hi. I was gonna ask where all the Asian people are. <laughs> <laughs> I assume they're all working. <laughs> But, uh, but the thing is, that, like, because there are, like, actually, like, when I was in Warsaw, I came across lots of Vietnamese people, and I was like, cool. Uh, and then I came to Rotsav, and the one, like, Vietnamese restu like, restaurant was at a food festival. I've never seen so many white people making Asian food for white people. <laughs> <laughs> but there was one Vietnamese stall, and I came up to them, and I was asking, you know, like, hey, do you guys have any, like, recommendations? And they're like, no, we're not from here. <laughs> so, assuming that you guys know nothing about Vietnam, I'm going to tell you a little bit about Vietnamese culture. Cool with that? Okay. So, Vietnamese culture is basically the same as Asian culture. Uh, you're you're going to disappoint your parents. That's a universal thing. But uh, I think with Vietnamese people, we get a bit of a head start, you know, because we it, it, it even starts from fucking birth. You know, so like uh, my name is Dan Daniel, but I also have a Vietnamese name. If you're thinking, did I come up with Daniel when I came here? No, my my parents got it. I can show you my birth certificate. But uh, the uh, the thing is that like my Vietnamese name is Bao Hui, which translates to something like precious genius. <laughs> so you know. I think my, that's on my parents. <laughs> There's no coming back from that. <laughs> thing is, it gets even weirder. Vietnamese culture has this thing where like boys get this like nickname, and uh, so for example, my cousin, his his English name is Oliver. His his Vietnamese name is like Pinky, which translates to something like Golden Sky, which is pretty cool. But uh, ever since he was a baby, uh, we've been calling him Kuti which literally translates to small penis. <laughs> I think that's a little unfair to babies. <laughs> but uh, in case you're worrying about him at all, he's married, he's got, he's got two kids, so you know, he's done it. <laughs> at least twice. <laughs> but uh, you know, his wife is Vietnamese too, so it fits. <laughs> <laughs> his, uh, his little brother is named Brandon, uh, we, we call it, like, his, his proper name is like Tian Zui, which translates to like Golden Opportunity, which is awesome. <laughs> but uh, we've been calling him Gubi, which translates to Round Penis. <laughs> In case you need to find a round thing that fits with it. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> so do you want to know what my penis nickname is? <laughs> my penis nickname is uh, Gu <laughs> which if you're picking it up, thank you Vietnamese people in the back there. <laughs> Spoiling my joke, ah! <laughs> we'll talk about restaurants later. 
uh, is 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 Uhui, which means something like genius penis. <laughs> and I can't help thinking, like, you know, that's uh, the only person who's ever said that it was also disappointed in me. <laughs> and it was my mom. <laughs> that's my time. But I had one last thing I wanted to do because we have such a nice big crowd tonight. Uh, I have a thing we do when we like sometimes when I occasionally host, which is not often, but anyway. Uh, I, I want to take a little video. Ooh, I'll put it up. And I, uh, I'll put it up on the page, on the Facebook page. But I want to take a little video. I'm going to ask you guys, like, are you having fun tonight? And then you guys are going to lie and say, woo, yeah. <laughs> and uh, yeah, okay, are you ready for this? Yeah. yeah. All right, all right, I'm going to start, assuming, okay. You guys having fun tonight? Yeah! yeah. Thank you guys, have a good night.